I can cook. I can really cook. One of you better send your brothers to come and marry me soon. <laughs> hey, I was lonely, oh. Why what? Are you so much shit? Sis, I'm here for the next three months. No, no. I'm not uh -uh. having that. No, that I'm not. I'm, I'm in isolation. I'm in isolation. I can't leave. Hey guys, so I left you guys yesterday having a really chilled one, having a movie night with some popcorn, and as you can see, it was much needed and I feel a lot better. Like I'm up today, um, it's probably about midday. I brushed my teeth, <laughs> um, done a bit of makeup, eyebrows, lip gloss and some concealer because we're going to film at least two videos today, if possible three, try and get some content ready for you guys this week because I didn't put anything out yesterday. I'm sticking to my herbal tea, I feel like anytime I want to have wine, I'm going to try and have a herbal tea but um, today I've decided that I'm going to film in my bedroom, it's a bit messy but... I just thought a nice, ooh, hang on a second, we're going to put salmon away. I just thought a different backdrop today would probably be quite welcome and because I'm in the mood anyway where all I want to do is stay in bed. <laughs> it's perfect if I can film from bed. So I've got my camera just set up on a tripod. I haven't brought any lights in. I'm going to see um, if using my lamp that's there is going to be enough. If it's not, I'll get some lights in, but the weather outside today isn't that great. But what I want to do is film these, this content, go outside for a wait, have lunch, because I'm actually quite hungry, haven't had lunch. Film this content, have lunch, go outside for a walk, and then come back and edit it and put it out. But yeah, I'm feeling super good today, super productive. I did not watch Criminal Minds anymore before bed. I think that really helped for once I didn't dream about kids being molested thank you Jesus um, today looking kind of cute though keeping it super cash in sweats and like my Christmas soft stockings <laughs> so yeah so guys first video is filmed it was easy it was I, it's not the funniest story town, but it was pretty good if you ask me, my opinion. So I'm going to go now and make lunch and then come back and film another video for you guys. I don't know if it's going to be a story time. It's going to be kind of like a little story time, but it's a sit down video. But yes, I'm making jello fries. So let me just put that on the stove and at least that can be cooking while I'm filming. So when I'm done, it will be ready to go. Mm. The weather is not nice today y'all, put you guys down here. I packed away my stew that I made um, almost two weeks ago, it's been in the fridge for like a while. So I'm going to use that to make my jello fries, it should be pretty easy and straightforward. <coughs> So guys, how many of you guys are actually adhering to this isolation? Like from speaking to some people, I'm realizing that, ah, me, I'm doing 100% adhering, 100% isolation. Some of y'all are only doing 60, 70%. How much percentage are all of you doing? Write down in the comment section. Let me understand myself. Eh? How many of you are having like real life dates? Eh? How many of you are having friends with benefits right now? Tell me, tell me or don't leave me out of this. <laughs> So my second video is filmed, I did a quick little change of outfit so it looked like, you know, not the same as the last video but I think I might film one more. If I can get three videos done today I'll probably be the most I've ever done in one day and that will just secure a lot of the content that I've got to post in this coming week. But um, my jello fries is coming along quite well, it's burnt a little bit at the bottom but my mum always says you can't cook jello fries good jello fries without burning it a little so i'm not too worried about that i'm gonna add a little bit more water this jello fries is gonna be a little bit different i usually add sweet corn to mine i'm gonna pop a bit of sweet corn in but yeah guys i just want to say i'm going to make a man a very happy husband one day i can cook i can really cook one of you better send your brothers to come and marry me soon <laughs> how can this all just be wasting only cooking for myself. Send me your brother's number. Tell him to DM me. Ugh. And yes, I date black men. Don't come and start telling me nonsense. I date black men. Tell him to call me. 
But yeah, like, I love cooking. I love cooking for two. And your girl can cook, man. Your girl can throw down in the kitchen. So, remember when my mom used to say, Who will marry you? Formula, you Who will marry you? All you know how to do is paint your face. To cook, you cannot cook. To clean, you cannot clean. <laughs> what are you gonna say now, mom? Huh? What are you gonna say now? <laughs> Uh, guys, I'm in a much oh sorry, I'm in a much better mood today than I was yesterday, and I'm back on healthy eating. That should last me quite a few days, you know. So yeah, I'm feeling good. I'm looking good. I'm feeling good. I'm super happy. Skin's out here looking like a yes, darling. So guys, guess who's done filming for the day? Three videos filmed. I'm so proud of myself. Now sitting down to eat my jello fries, chicken, and um continue with that show I was watching on Netflix yesterday, The Letter for the King. It's alright. Nothing special, a bit predictable in my opinion. So but yeah, I've started watching it. I'm just gonna finish it off. But yeah, Sunday, another chill day. I just feel really happy that I've got three videos filmed. One already edited. I'm just waiting for it to finish like uploading to youtube and you guys will have yourself a video guys i just had the craziest idea I don't, it's not that crazy you know but i've decided i'm going to go to london tonight and surprise my sister like i literally just jumped out of bed two minutes ago and i'm like yeah i'm gonna do it i'm gonna go to london with a bag and isolate with my sister because um you guys know that i've been struggling recently just being home alone all the time it's just a lot like I think most people are quite smart they've gone into isolation with their boyfriends their girlfriends their mothers their family I me mean, I'm just sitting at home every day like <laughs> I'm sad I'm bored so I've just yeah I'm gonna go do it and I also realized today I think I'm the only personal shout out to the rest of y'all that have been really taking this social distancing and isolating things seriously because i'm seeing your friends you know going to their family's house and going back to their house i'm seeing you one day and um miriam mariam oh god what the hell's wrong with me you know filming sit down videos together i'm talking to people they say yeah they just got back from seeing their girlfriend uh -uh. All of you are just travelling all over the place and I'm the only person suffering in the air Nah, I can't. My mental health needs this. So I've just got my suitcase out and I'm going to pack it. Like, I would never normally go to my sister's place with um, this large suitcase. But, y'all, i got to take my quarantine food. <laughs> All that food I bought for quarantine, I gotta take it with me. Um, and plus I've got to take all my filming equipment, laptops, and then there's also clothes. Not that I'm going to need much apart from a lounge room and sweats. But the worst part of isolation and quarantining it not at your house is needing your creature comforts and not having them. That's probably why I haven't gone to my sister's yet. So I haven't even told her I'm coming. But she better be homo. Uh-uh, where else will you be during Corona? My sister, you better be home or... Hmm, did you not hear Boris say stay at home? So, yeah, it's going down. I'm going to pack and then we're going to head off. Exciting. So, guys, I'm on the train. Luggage in the hand. It's literally the first time I've really left my flat in, like two weeks to actually go somewhere other than the supermarket so i'm actually quite excited but i don't know what i'll do if anybody stops me like the police and it's like where are you going um i don't know i'm not sure i'm confused i'm lost <laughs> like this carriage is like so empty the train station was so empty i was actually really surprised the trains were still running but I'm already excited, I feel rejuvenated, like one thing I was thinking of today is it's so irritating having to cook all my own meals like I've never cooked so much in my life my breakfast I make it, my lunch I make it, my dinner I make it I know this is the first, first world problems because there are people out there that don't have food but it's so irritating, I've never had to do that before, you know Sometimes a man wants to take you to dinner, sometimes you're going to get a takeaway But none of that in this corona lockdown season I'm having to cook every damn meal But at least if I go to my sister's we can alternate And it's like, oh, the workload is cut in half, thank you Jesus You know, and she's actually got a spare room as well So I've brought lots of stuff, like guys 
how sad am I? I've got my teddy bear money stuffed in there because as I said, the worst part about quarantining away from your house is not having your creature comforts. And I couldn't bear the thought of leaving him at home. So I even packed like a little candle because like if I'm feeling down, something to perk me up a bit but I'm already feeling it much better don't judge me guys I'm still taking precautions I've still got my gloves I've got my face mask there's absolutely nobody in this train so I feel like my risk is extremely low hopefully we'll stay like this I'm gonna get to Waterloo I'll probably get an uber as well because I don't want to go on the underground so yeah I keep the eyes laid as possible so guys I just got to London I'm outside my sister's place. We're about to surprise her. She better be home because otherwise I'm in trouble. I've got some sort of keys. I'm gonna let myself in. And I'll probably freak her out. She'll probably be like, who the f is in my house? Hello. Fear no catch you. <laughs> <laughs> what? Why? You are a bit scared. You didn't even see me. Well, you were scared when you saw me, but no reaction, guys. I was hoping for a reaction. No absolute reaction. Why you take the keys off me? When well, you're meant to be like, thank you, sister, for protecting me. Yeah, isolating. I'm just going to my room. I will make myself at home. Is that okra? Perhaps. And then perhaps. <laughs> so this will be my new home for the next few nights. Ah, sister, I thought you'd be happy to see me. Oh, look at the way you're doing. I actually thought it was the neighbors. I didn't actually realize you were inside until I saw something moving. <laughs> <laughs> saw he saw something moving. Yeah. Because like, uh, uh, you heard the noise from the neighbors. So, so, I was like, ah, ah, this isn't my place. Like, I just saw you like just, set up. Yeah. Who's that? Because I saw something moving there. I was like, what? So he's actually in this house. <laughs> no way. No, that pissed me off. <laughs> I thought that's why you gave me a key, so I can just be no, letting myself that in. Is not, I gave you the key in an emergency if I need it. And please go and wash your hands. I'm going to wash everything, don't worry. Uh, even my Uber driver told me I should make sure I wash the handle. Uh, Waterloo. He told me to make sure I wash the handle of my suitcase. So my guy probably already has symptoms, I don't know. Do you have any bacterial wipes? You don't? Mmm, I need wipes. What are you doing here, sis? <laughs> hey. I was lonely, oh! Yeah, I need that. Don't stop to enjoy my loneliness. No, ah. Uh, should be tomorrow's your last day of work. Mm -hmm. Exactly, so I came just in time. I cannot be alone anymore. Depression started with hits. I said no. Amen. Thank you. I will make myself at home. But let me just wash my hands first. I'll come chat to you. So guys, I've just wiped everything down. Travelled with my bacterial wipes. I'm gonna make myself a home. Money, we're home. You can go here, money. Okay, so I already feel better. My sister's asking me if our boss had jello fries. All the way from Hampshire, she wants me to bring jello fries. Yeah. Uh, how come what I cooked the other day just stay at home? No. I brought you the fries. <laughs> um, bro, I brought a lot of food, you know, but I'm really hungry, so like, where's the okra? What? I so much shit. Sis, I'm here for next three months. No, no. <laughs> I'm not having that. No, I'm not. I'm, I'm in isolation. I'm in isolation. I can't leave. No, me, I was enjoying my alone time. No, please. Enjoy your, you can enjoy your alone time, oh. Uh -uh. Just. Give me more.
Give me schedule for when I can go in kitchen. We will do isolation separately. Classic. She doesn't even want me here. Can you believe? I remember then when we done it also for the street. Knowing one day you go pay.